Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing a school supplies haul. Many of you have requested this so, so much, so I decided to do one. Um, so yeah, I started school, by the way, tomorrow, which is the 2nd of September, and I'm really, really sad because, I mean, I just wanted summer to last forever, and now I'm going to school. I don't have a problem going back to school, it's just uh, waking up early and doing homework and homework and homework and I just don't like it and also to add on I will be uh, telling you guys who won the giveaway winner at the end of the video so don't forget that and I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's get started so I'm going to start off of how my book bag looks and for my book bag it just looks like this it's just a book bag with the Cal like the California flag. I got this for my birthday. I got it. Uh, I did a haul for it, uh, birthday or Christmas, one of those. But I got it myself from the money my mom gave me. So yeah, I haven't. Ha I would say I don't have it for a year, but I've had it for months. So I decided to reuse it because this is literally my favorite book bag, and I mean. Cali vibes, you know? So this book bag only has two pockets. It has the big one and then it also has the small one. I'm sorry if I kind of hold it awkward. I have like all my stuff in there already because like I said, I go in school tomorrow. So I'm going to start off with like the smaller area. Um, they're not all in order or anything. I just threw them in like I said because I mean... I mean, everything's going to go into, like, my locker and my desk and all that when I go to school tomorrow. And if you want what's in, what's in my book bag video, like this video, so, like, what I have every time I bring my book bag home, then, yeah, just give this video a thumbs up. Yeah, so what I first have in here are index cards, and I only need two, so this is all, like, my school supplies. I'm not going to show you, like, the tissues and all that, because, I mean, everybody needs them. I'm just looking at basics and all that, so I have two index cards, which are ruled, because I need some index cards. I have Expo markers, and then they gave me a small free one. Then I have two glue sticks, and then... That is basically all. Going into the last and big uh, thing, uh, pocket, I mean, at the top I have a, what do you call it, a pencil case, and we're not allowed to take boxes, so I like these anyways, because I could just put them into the binder, and I have stuff in there, so I wouldn't take as much, as much space as I would need. And all I have in here is my scissors, which I'm reusing because these are literally like the best scissors I ever use. They're like so sharp and they cut, cut so, 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 so straight. Like I swear, they're like the best scissors. I got mine at, um, I really don't remember if it was Walmart or Target, but you guys should get some of these. These are like literally the best scissors I've used. So I've used them for like since I was in elementary school. Then I have... Two Sharpies, blue and yellow, just because, I mean, dark. those are cute colors. Then I have a pink eraser because everybody makes mistakes, and we're not even allowed to use whiteouts, so, yeah. I have a calculator, which just looks like that, and I got it at Target for 12 bucks because we I use it for math. Then I have a blue mini sharpener because you never know when you need to sharpen your pencils and then I have like five pencils because we only need five and then I have blue and black pens and I only have uh, two, two of each and then I also have red pens because we always have to correct things so yeah then, last thing I have in here are my mechanical pencils because you can never go wrong. I always use mechanical pencils because all you do is lead, you need to sharpen, and it's just like a backup. And what I like about this is that when you do like testings, 
um, and you're always supposed to use a wooden pencil. These actually have uh, a lead that actually will make it work for testing. So like I could use it and it'd be so much better than just using a basic white pencil. I mean, hello. White. What am I even talking about? Just like an overview of it. This is like all it looks. It is so heavy because I have so many binders in here. But yeah, I have colored pencils because we color and all that. So I mean, why not? I have crayons once again, just in case we need a color. Then I have my Lexar. I if you use um if you guys recommend if I can't speak today. I also got markers because once again coloring I mean color is fun, right? I mean Yeah, and then I have a protractor. I always sometimes say this wrong, like I don't know, it sounds like a tractor, like I'm going to mow a lawn or something. So yeah, this is my protractor, and then it's a six like inch long thing. It's just like that, and it's purple, if it shows blue, I don't know, but it's purple. Yeah, got it. Then, my favorite part of like my whole school supplies is my planner. This is how my planner looks, or my school, you, they don't give you planners, you have to get your own. And I like the fact that I've always need a planner because I like to plan my homework and all that. Otherwise, I'll forget what I'm doing or assignments I have to turn in. So this is really, really helpful. So mine is just, looks like that and it has my name on there. Then, I like that it has like, the tabs here ready for you. So, I'm just going to go to... December just cuz that's my birthday, you know guys mark your calendars December 7 is my birthday, you know Just tell me happy birthday, you know the next things are my composition notebooks uh, So all like my like notebooks and folders you see I have them color-coded which kind of like sucks cuz I mean I like to get my regular folders but, I mean, at the same time, it doesn't really matter. But, I was going to say, so, like, for us, we have them color-coded for every subject. But, yeah, for math, it's black. It could be black with white or anything. So, my composition notebooks are like this. This year, they didn't say you have to get the black and white ones like this. So, I just thought it'd be fun to get, like, a different design. So, all I needed was three for math. So I got just the regular basic one. I also got this one with like numbers and letters. And I just thought this was really cool. And then I also got this one which seems really cool because it just has like stars and things. And I just have my name on it by the way. And yeah, and then I needed one um, composition for, I think it was for reading class when we do like our bell ringers and our, yeah that stuff so I just decided to go some kind of cool way and get myself something because we like to do fun stuff on it since last year I was in a, my homeroom was a reading teacher class we did like really cool stuff in our journals and all that so this is like our journal and it's just like that I like the fact that this isn't like plastic it's like the not plastic paper and it's plastic and it just looks really really cute and I thought this was so cute so I just thought to go creative since this is my journal you know you feel me so then I also got a what do you call it, graph paper this is probably for math since I mean or science one of those I really don't know and yeah I just got the skinny ones which is weird because they didn't ask for loose leaf but if they don't ask to lose sleep, you still bring some because you don't know who's going to ask you or if you're going to need any. And, yeah. So, about the color-coded, I have, um, what do you call, five different folders is, I think. Yeah, because I have five classes. Well, I have more than five, but I don't count, like, the special ones and all that. So, I have these folders. And my folders, I always like to get the... The bendable plastic ones, just because I don't like the paper ones. They rip so easily. Like, half during the middle school, they would always rip. So, I started using these, and I uh, love these. So, you could get these at Target. This is where I usually buy all of this. 
So, yeah, and then red is for reading. Then I got blue is for social studies, and I love this. Uh, yellow is for English slash writing. Um, I only got five star for science and math just because those are the uh, most classes I usually put paper and I save to look back at so I decided to get like the really hard and sturdy ones and I'm reusing my math one just because it's like actually in good use and all that as you can see and then got green for science so math and yeah those are all the folders I have next I have which is just my basic everybody knows this it's just the ruler then going with my notebooks there's the same subject meaning as the folders and I just have a yellow one, one subject, and this is the only paper one I got was because I couldn't find it in the other material, so I just got it, and whatever, so I just got that one in yellow, for, then I got one in red, which these are actually the bendable ones, and I like that they have pockets inside, which just makes things really easy, and they're really big to actually write on, and, I, and they will last me the whole year, so I got... Uh, it in red, then in green, uh, black, I was about to say blue, by the way, that's throwing, I'm just throwing all my, um, what do you call, supplies on the floor, I mean, yeah, then blue, and I accidentally ripped the thing out, so, yeah, and then the last things I have in my book bag, which are my binders, and I think Five Star has literally the best binders ever. Well, Five Star has everything good for school supplies. But yeah, I have a Five Star binder. This is a one inch binder, if you're wondering. This is for like all like my reading things and classes and all that. And inside, I have a like a light blue pouch and I actually bought the pouch separate it didn't come in there I just put it in there so I, I could just throw in things and the binder came in with one divider with like pockets so I think that's really helpful and I really like it and it's one of those bendable and not like cardboard ones so that's really good and then the last thing I have is this light blue binder which is actually tinted because inside it's white and this is like my favorite binder i love this and this is for like my music class and i love music so yeah and then inside i have loose leaf that i had on that i bought because like i said you never know when you need loose sleeve and in music we use loose sleep so that's why i got some and then um i got i got the dividers separate because we needed dividers five dividers and they're all classes they're as well. They're all different colors and all that and they also have pockets too so it'd be really helpful if you ever have binders I recommend you get dividers because dividers really help you keep organized and I'm an organized person. I don't like to be messy and lose everything and forget everything. I like like being organized and able to work things out especially for school because I mean you don't want to end up doing the same grade all over again and yeah so that is all for my haul i hope you guys really enjoyed this video and you got tips of what you could buy for your school supplies or add on things or organization so yeah keep watching so you know who won the giveaway and by the way i chose the giveaway fairly i don't choose people based on if i like them if i know them if i don't know you i just choose it fairly i have an app on my phone that chooses random names so that's what i like to use so it could be as fairly as possible so let's go see who won the giveaway so the person who won is going to win the five six summer album and yeah, a lot of you actually wanted to win this, so I'm like, uh, it's so sad seeing not all of you winning, because I swear I would have bought it so many CDs and given it to you guys, but only have one winner. It's actually more different and cooler than mine, so yeah, so the winner for the giveaway is, drumroll please, is Delilah. Delilah, congratulations, you have won my giveaway. I uh, will follow you on Twitter which I probably already do 
and I will DM you and I'll find a way of how to like ship this to you and I'll just find a way of how to get this CD to you so congratulations by the way I have not opened it yet as you can see it is brand new so yeah thank you guys for watching my video and I hope you guys love this video give it a thumbs up and subscribe and if you didn't win don't worry there's so many more on um, what do you call there's so many more to come more giveaways so don't worry you'll win soon my next one yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video and see you guys on my next video